We're joined here now by Jamie Bernstein of Women Thinking Inc. all the way out from Chicago. Jamie, how are you? Hi, good, thanks. Now, tell me a little bit about the vaccine clinic that you put on this year here at TAM. Well, it's not me. It's all of Women Thinking Inc. Uh, we, it wasn't just a solo effort? You by yourself? No, I, I, I wish. Um, but basically, we had 250 free vaccines, um, Tdaps, that we were giving out to anybody at TAM who wants them. Um, a lot of people, a lot of adults just don't know that they need their booster shots. It, also, a lot of uh, insurance companies do not cover it, do not cover booster shots for adults. So we come here and try to... we. Instead of like you having to go to a clinic, we try to bring it to you um, and make it a little more convenient and maybe more people will will get vaccinated. And this is the second year you've done this, right? Yes, this is the second year. Ernest, and have any adults walked out of here autistic after getting one of these booster shots? Not one. Not one reported, yeah. but you know... All right, so tell me a little bit about Women Thinking Inc. What, what is it that you guys do? Okay, so we really have kind of two things that we do. The first one is just general science and women in science and that kind of thing. Um, so we, we put on a lot of events. Most of them are in Chicago or the Midwest. Um, so we do we do a big camping trip up in Wisconsin every year. It's a star party camping trip. This year we brought in uh, Nicole Gugliucci, the noisy astronomer, came. We went up to Wisconsin. It's, it was a whole weekend. We went camping and we looked at stars and we visited an observatory. Um, so we do stuff like that, just kind of fun things. We also did a trip to Fermilab to see the Tevatron before it was shut down. So science, stuff like that. Um, and then kind of the other side of the, the other thing that we do is we do vaccine outreach, just pro-vaccine stuff. Um, some of the stuff, part, part of that is coming to like skeptic events like this and running vaccine clinics. And the other part of that is talking to parents um, or creating material for parents, non-skeptic parents, parents that maybe aren't sure about vaccines. So we create material, we try to talk to them, and try to convince them to get vaccinated and get their children vaccinated. And if they get vaccinated, they can actually get a hug, because check out the shirt and the sign here. Yeah. Hug me, I'm vaccinated, vaccine clinic here. So how, where, where did that come about? How long have you been doing that? Where, I, it, the, the, the logo or the, the hug me, I'm vaccinated thing came up before I was real involved, but I'm actually pretty sure that we came up with that first. And then we're like, we, we love this. We have to do something. Like, maybe we should start talking to people about vaccines. And it kind of grew from there. Um, but, uh, yeah, we will trade a hug for a vaccine. And everybody loves hugs. It's not a bad deal, folks, let me tell you. Now, what what is it that you like most about TAM, aside from the vaccine clinic? Um, I just seeing all my friends. Like, it's, it's great to come. This is my fourth year. And um, it's great to come back and see people. There are people that I only see at TAM um, that I basically never see or even not even like every other year at TAM maybe they go um, but I feel like we're we're back like I see them again and it's like we haven't even been gone so great well enjoy the rest of TAM congratulations on your success with the clinic and good luck in the future with the Women Thinking Inc. Thank you.